following video was recorded in April of 2022, and I am very out of video ideas again. I don't know how this happened again, so I'm finally releasing the video because I've just kind of forgotten about it. Uh, so yeah, keep in mind this is a little dated, but it still feels very TSC if you if you get what I mean. Hello everybody and welcome back to the Stickbot channel and in today's video I am going to be discussing something very important, very close to home, and that is Stickbot Customs, specifically these three right here. Batman, Martian Man Hunter, and The Flash. Or Batbot, Martian Bot Hunter, and still the Flash. Now why am I discussing this? Well it's uh it's quite simple really. These are some of my earliest customs, and they're actually from some of my earliest stickbots ever, so they're really important to me. Not to mention they really helped with my whole customization journey. I mean, these two had like early, <sighs> just hit my lamp, hold on. I, I could cut that out, but I'm not going to. Um, these two had really early versions, and if I can find images, they should be up on screen now, but I have since redone them actually a couple of times. But yet again, they're still pretty dated and are not up to the quality standards that I like to hold for my customs today. Um, a couple examples I'm trying to find here, Zombified Pigman, I mean, pfft. I mean this guy, look at him, does not look anything like these customs here, and I try to keep a way higher standard of custom nowadays, and these guys just don't fit the bar. So I'll be scrapping them, as in removing their paint, just destroying them, getting rid of any resemblance of what they once were. I've done this in the past a couple of times, here's an example. This used to be Ed from Ed's World, uh, image of what he used to look like on screen now. Um, and I'll be turning him into Doc Ock from Spider-Man Away Home. I used that stick bot to start a custom of a zombie from Minecraft. Still haven't finished him. And then one that I'm currently doing, this used to be Captain America that I was working on, but I am scrapping him for the homemade suit from Spider-Man Homecoming. Uh, this is how far I got on the homemade suit. I may finish him someday, uh, I don't know. Now, these three, I do not have any plans for what they're going to be. Now, why don't I just make them the same customs? Well, mainly because their faces aren't still intact. In order to get rid of his face, the like the paint on him, his face would be destroyed. His face is long gone. His face is long gone. I mean, here. <laughs> this is a painted on face. This is not the original face, as you can see. It's painted over. It is a yellow stick butt underneath there, but for all intents and purposes, that's pretty much gone um but yeah so that's one reason another reason is because i just do not need these customs right now i kind of want other characters and though i plan on ordering some more stick butts soon um for the time being i'm just gonna get rid of these guys and turn them into something completely new um again like when i'm, I'm making this video because they're special to me i don't really use them ever anymore just because like i said they're outdated and i really don't make that kind of animation anymore where i need licensed characters the most of the original characters like me and the boys you know um so i'm getting rid of these guys i'll be just destroying the paint scraping it off sanding down the customs and then using their bases for completely new characters um, these are not the only DC customs I've made. These are, I've had other ones that I could find. I made Joker from Joker, which does need updated. Don't get me wrong. It's, it's pretty old. But the difference is this will be just a better looking version of the Joker. It won't be a completely different character. I made Reverse Flash, and I actually really like this one for how long. It, I made Reverse Flash at the same time I made that Flash, um, but, uh, I actually like how this one looks still. He does need some touching up though. So I'll, the only thing I'll be doing is touching him up. And then Harley Quinn, holy crap. This is so outdated, it's insane. I mean, oh boy, we do not talk about this one. I used to be proud of this. Can you believe it? The hair is gone. Actually, the hair, I man dismantled the hair. It's gone. I used to be proud of this piece of garbage, but I'll be revamping this. It's just a better, better looking Harley Quinn. But the reason, that these guys aren't like I already said they'll be getting completely new customs and I just wanted to make a video talking you can see the dust oh that's bad that's really there's a lot my room is really dusty but these guys will be getting completely new customs um and I just want to make a video talking about them before they were gone forever because like I said they're special to me they're they're like some of my first ever stick bots and some of my first ever stick bot customs I don't think I'd be where I am today if it weren't for these guys I mean really part of my customizing journey and it's really important that I document their last days pretty much 
another thing to note, I'm not sure when you guys are getting this video because um, I'm currently at 99 videos at the time of recording this video and I want my 100th video to be the 100th video special. Um, so I'm just gonna keep this one because I, I'm recording this in advance because I really want to dismantle these guys, scrape off the paint, turn them into something else, but I can't do that until I record the video of their like last moments, which is why I am, I am recording this now. But hopefully I'll get editing the 100th video special soon. But I figured before I grin them, I'd like to go over what they look like and have like a record of them before they are gone forever. Here we have Batbot. Now, if I could find an image uh, on screen, you'll see an image of what he used to look like. This was made with the template that Stickbot Central made years ago with Henry um, of how to make a Batman custom. And I followed that to a T. Um, but then I repainted him a couple of times and now he looks like this. I mean, out of all of them, I mean, this one is still my favorite because it just, I think it works, kinda. I went for like a metal armor painted black, but it's all scraped up and it's just, it does not hold up, okay? Underneath it's a tan stick bot and I don't really think that works per se. I feel like I could use that for something else. And I mean, just overall, look at this. This just does not hold up nowadays and I'm not happy with it the slightest. Underneath him is a gunmetal gray, and then there's a bunch of foam, and it's painted all black and stuff in it. He just gotta go. He just has to go. Next up is Martian Bot Hunter. This guy has had absolutely zero changes. I mean, I think that I repainted the dark blue armor like one time, and that's it. Yeah, no, he, ooh boy. Looks like a three-year-old made this, holy crap. Like, look at how bad this cape, look at how bad this cape is. Literally spare foam that I had lying around. I did not know. Cause I was too lazy to make another. There's blue paint there. Oh my goodness, this is just so bad. I used hot glue, bro. I used hot glue, and it's all, oh, dude. This is disgusting. I'm, I, ew. Uh, and the, oh, the eyes. They're not even even. They're just like dots of paint. Oh, that's disgusting. Oh, and the armor. What even is this? And this paint job. How was I satisfied with that in the slightest? And the legs. Oh, this whole thing just makes me cringe. Ah. Yeah, no, he said literally no changes. I've thought about it in the past. Maybe I should update him. So I'm like, yeah, no, I'm not going to miss him. He's not even like an important DC character. I could have made like a Ninja Turtle or like, I don't know, the Hulk or I don't know, some green character that has more significance than Martian Manhunter. But for some reason, I saw a green stick button. I'm like, oh yeah, Martian Manhunter, because why not? I mean, I love Martian Manhunter. Don't get me wrong. I'm just such a, ugh, I'm so glad I'm getting rid of him. Now, this one's probably going to hurt the most. It's the Flash. I'd have no clue what this, like, white stuff on his face is, but it's not worth fixing because I'd have to completely destroy the head, essentially, to repaint it, and I'm not doing that. Not to mention the paint. It's just really, really, really outdated. And again, here's, like, if I could find an image, the old version on screen. <sighs> Boy. It's, I mean, these are gonna hurt to get rid of, but it's also gonna be good because these guys are just so, so bad just so bad man <sighs> yeah so i mean i kind of tried to base him off of like his season five outfit from the crappy cw show well i mean it was okay in the earlier seasons it's just but and then i kind of went did my own thing look at that symbol how was i satisfied with that symbol at all yeesh young me was a menace to society these aren't that bad i can i can handle these i wouldn't mind reusing these but that ugh, everything else about this guy so yeah, that's it. Just wanted to document these guys before they were gone forever. And his legs suck, that's the best part. All right, uh, I don't know if this will be included in the video or not, but update, <sighs> their armor is gone. Any 3D element is just gone on these two. Um, here's Batman, here's Batbot's armor. Holy, holy crap, dude. There's his cape, kind of got messed up because of the glue in the back. Um, there are, like things on his arms. And he, I painted his whole body silver, like on the first coat of paint um, that he had. Like some of the neat, the, the shin things, his chest plate. There's a crumb here. Don't know why there's a crumb on my set. Oh, this is just so bad. The utility belt. Oh my word. This, ugh. Memories, dude. The Martian bot hunter. He's got the thing the cuffs on like his arms and shins his terrible terrible cape his chest plate oh dude and then for the flash i mean his 
thing lightning bolt thing this one did not come off easily and it's in pieces and in the trash but that one came off in one foul swoop and that's where it is so yeah in general we're just uh we're not gonna talk about these guys we they're done this is probably the last update you're gonna see after this just assume that they are clean slates and i might you know what i might show you hold on wait because i might show you what they look like as clean slates um because like i said this video won't be coming out for a while so you know I guess I'm going to get to scraping the rest of the paint off. Oh, I just found something awful that you can do with a stick bot. All right, hold on. Okay. So you get them like this. Right? And then you go... Oh, that's great. That's great. All right, progress update, and I didn't even put my phone on the tripod for this one, but I got all the paint off of him, and his face is destroyed, so, like, don't, don't, I, it's, it, paint's gone. It was a pain. Uh, and when I do make a custom, I'll probably sand him down, because it looks really unfinished, but I can kind of handle that. Like, compare him to him, you know, there's a lot less noticeable, like, stuff all over him, you know? So when I do paint him, it'll probably be a custom where the entire body is covered, and then I can just, uh, then I can just, um, sand down the body. Yeah, like, I didn't even unlock my phone for this one, because I just want to get that out of the way. That's the first update, and I haven't even moved on to those two. Well, here they are in the modern day. Uh, Batbot here, like, everything is gone from him. He's down to pretty much nothing. Same goes for Marshall Bond Hunter. I'm pretty sure I already saw that. Now, the Flash is a really interesting case. I used the crap, the crap, the scrap stick bot to make this guy, who in retrospect, I should have used that one because he's a tannish color and I don't get why I used a yellow stick bot with red paint. That was a very dumb decision. But regardless, that's where he is now. And there's, you can see what he used to look like before I painted over him. And um, yeah, good use of my time. So, of course, thank you all so much for watching. Um, make sure to join my Discord server. Follow me on Instagram, follow me on TikTok, and um, Twitter. Yes, I have a Twitter for some reason. Um, and do all that stuff below. Um, and, of course, as always, peace out. Also, leap, tan stick butt, yellow stick butt, green stick butt. When these are all said and done, tell me what customs you'd like me to customize them into in the, in the comments. Any suggestions you have? Peace out.